world-renowned airport. First F1 night race. Food that excites your palate. And a vibrant cosmopolitan lifestyle. Put them all together and you get your Singapore. Why Singapore? Like, do, I, do I share taxes and, and all that? No, you don't have to pay taxes unless you are a Singaporean. But just like Singaporeans, you get to enjoy everything else. After all, it's also your Singapore. But as a slogan, your Singapore seems to lack some cake. It's kind of tacky because it doesn't rhyme and it's not, it doesn't stick in your head. Every country has to have something to shout about. So your is not shouting enough. It's not really like interesting. Others think that the slogan is too vague. I don't quite know what it's trying to say. It seems to be a government-driven logo. Kind of quiet. It's just not. It doesn't do anything. Some are confused. It's called your Singapore. My Singapore. Okay. No, your Singapore. Your Singapore. It's in yours, comma Singapore. Your Singapore. It's actually one word. Oh, your Singapore. And some don't feel anything about it. It's not ours. We're tourists. So it can't be my Singapore. When you heard about the tagline, your Singapore, what was your first? I have no emotion. My first crush through my mind was, it doesn't connect with me. A tagline that has no emotion and is something that's virtually non-quantifiable lacks that kind of a depth. But the Singapore Tourism Board says it's about making tourists' visits to Singapore an individual experience. Singapore's concentration of sights, sounds, tastes, cultures and attractions is packed into a compact, user-friendly, comfortable and accessible space. Singaporeans and visitors can personalise their unique Singapore experience according to their individual needs and interests. And this is how Singapore becomes yours. I think the term yours is, is pretty good because uh, it makes it seem as if you can make Singapore whatever you want it to be. And I think it's quite warm. Well, it is for everybody, isn't it? Because it's a, lots of people settled here, all different races. So it is your, it's yours. It's for everybody. There are a lot of things to do in Singapore, so it's up to you what you want. The views are split on whether your Singapore works. So if it doesn't work for you, what will? Okay, maybe along the lines, uh, your home away from home, something like that. Lovely Singapore. Lovely Singapore. Why lovely Singapore? I don't know, because it's small, but it has a lot of things inside Singapore. A special Singapore. You can call it best of all words. Huh? Coming back to the future, I don't know. Coming back to tomorrow, I don't know. Um, okay, maybe not. Next up, we compare your Singapore to other countries' slogans. What's Australia's tagline? Um, where, where the bloody hell are you? 